other region on earth is there such a rich diversity of cultures. Traditions rooted in antiquity live on, cherished by people with many heritages. Southeast Asia, a vast sweep of island and peninsular nations on trade routes as old as written history. Through the ages, a bridge between the old and the new. Today, more than ever, Southeast Asia is a crossroads where ageless wisdom interacts with innovative skills to yield fresh solutions, where people are searching for new answers to problems, some ages old, such as making better use of the land, and others which grow from the complexities of modern life, better management of precious energy resources, improving services in cities, increasing productivity in many areas of business and industry and still others which call for new ways to preserve the best of the past and help educate for the future. In these and many other areas of human endeavor, the common and vital need is for information, the right information in the right place at the right time. In country after country, IBM computers are helping fill that need and IBM people are committed to finding better ways to put information to work for their customers and for their nations. Los Banos, the Philippines. Six agricultural and forest research institutions have joined forces here to form the Agricultural Resource Center. Its mission, to develop new ways to increase crop production. Mountains of information on plant genetics, soil chemistry, fertilizers, climate and other factors are collected, organized, and analyzed. IBM is a partner in this major research effort, contributing the use of a computer and a team of skilled IBM people. New crop varieties more resistant to insects and disease have been developed. In some areas of the Philippines, yields have doubled. And these new techniques are being made available to other countries. The computer is also being used as a management tool to help improve agricultural productivity in other nations. In Indonesia, to increase fertilizer output for richer fields. In Thailand, for better planning and forecasting of rice movements from countryside to city to export markets. And the computer is helping rural development in other ways. In Malaysia, the National Electricity Board is engaged in a major project which will expand the availability of electric power with the help of a computer to determine power demands, to project plant and equipment needs, to solve engineering problems, effective ways to extend this vital energy resource to new areas, both rural and industrial, are being carefully developed and implemented. Computers, helping to bring better services to people, in rural areas and in the growing cities. Some three and a half million people in Kowloon and the new territories in Hong Kong depend on China Light and Power Company for electricity. From skyscrapers laced in neon to backstreet markets, power needs change constantly. To meet these needs, an IBM computer monitors power transmission and helps determine the most efficient and most economical generating pattern. And at the Taiwan Power Company for more than three million accounts, a computer helps keep track of power usage, prepares billing information, and supplies fast, accurate answers to customer inquiries. Computers help people in cities in other ways. Officials in Singapore use a computer to help manage a major public housing development program to which more than half the population has obtained comfortable, lower-income living quarters. The city of Jakarta issues more than a half million vehicle registrations a year. Car owners used to spend as long as two weeks to register and insure a vehicle 
and pay the necessary fees. Now it takes less than an hour. An IBM computer helps speed this process and also aids city planners in bringing improvements to other administrative operations. The Kowloon Motor Bus Company moves two million passengers a day through busy city streets. Keeping its fleet of 1,600 buses operational is a challenge. One important way a computer helps company managers maintain good service is by providing timely status reports on an inventory of more than six million items stored in five different warehouses. Wherever the need, whatever the function, the answer remains the same. Get the right information to the right place at the right time. Computers, helping to make cities more livable. Helping manufacturers produce more and better products. At this textile mill in South Korea, computer-aided quality control helps ensure precise matching of colors in high-quality yarns and fabrics bound for world markets. And at Song Yung Cement Company, also in South Korea, domestic production has doubled in less than eight years, and production for export markets has grown at five times that rate. An IBM computer processes many kinds of information for the company's 19 plants. Chemical analysis for quality control, marketing and maintenance data, and perhaps most important, key factors in planning for future growth. A computer is helping plan an expansion program which calls for this plant to become one of the largest producers of cement in the world. Rubber World Philippines produces nearly 40 million pairs of shoes and sandals a year for domestic and overseas markets. To help the company maintain its ability to compete effectively, managers look to a computer for the timely information they need to control production costs and quality. IBM Computers, helping people put information to work for people in manufacturing the goods they need and transporting them to where they are needed. The Port of Singapore loads and unloads more than 1,000 container ships a year, quickly, reliably. A computer has become an essential management tool, providing a continuous flow of information to port officials about what is happening in the container yard as it happens. The ability to make better, faster decisions now permits shippers to clear port in hours instead of days. Handling warehouse shipments of thousands of products each day can be a challenge. But at Inchcape, one of Southeast Asia's major trading companies, a computer helps managers effectively control administrative complexity. One of Hong Kong's largest department stores manages more than 100,000 inventory items with the help of an IBM computer. The computer also helps managers update their knowledge of consumer trends and provide better services. Now customers have an even better chance of finding what they want when they want it. Computers, helping to move goods and products, helping busy people on the move. The business is transportation, but the product is service. Airlines could not function without prompt, accurate answers to questions of passenger reservations, ticket accounting, maintenance, and cargo operations. IBM is helping with information tools and a world of experience that can be applied anew as needs expand. Air transportation in Southeast Asia is opening the world to the Orient and the Orient to the world. And IBM is helping. Automatic word processing helps hotels produce error-free documents responding to inquiries about reservations, facilities, services, and special events. Efficient transportation and travel services help accelerate economic development. 
so do good financial services. Computers are helping banks in many countries serve their customers better, speeding transfers of funds and updating accounts, providing information to help bank managers respond more effectively to the financial needs of business, industry, and agriculture. These problems are common to many countries. Others are unique and call for solutions blending the best of the old with the best of the new. In Thailand, English and the Thai language are often used together in correspondence, in business, and management reports. IBM people in Thailand responded to this need with the development of typewriters with dual language capability and computer input and output devices that can handle the full complex character set of the Thai language. Bridging the old and the new, preserving the ancient. For hundreds of years, the remarkable Buddhist temple of Borobudur stood in silent testimony to the past, lost in the volcanic debris and dense jungle of central Java. Time had ravaged the monument, and it threatened to collapse. Today, the temple is the focus of an international restoration effort, and IBM played a vital role. With the help of technical support and data processing services contributed by IBM, during a critical two-year period, a comprehensive plan was developed for the removal, cataloging, cleaning, matching, and replacement of hundreds of thousands of stones and statues. The computer continues to help schedule and manage this complex project as Bora Badur is restored to enrich the lives of present and future generations. Computers, helping to preserve the past, to manage complex problems of the present, to plan for a better tomorrow. And what of those young people upon whom tomorrow depends? In a number of countries in Southeast Asia, IBM computer systems are aiding in the educational process. At the Chinese University of Hong Kong, a computer helps 5,000 students register for the courses they want, gives university officials the timely information needed to manage classroom space more effectively, and helps plan for the future. At Tom Kong College near Taipei, IBM people working closely with college officials helped plan and install a computer-assisted education system for more than 10,000 students, helping them learn a variety of subjects at their own pace, enabling them to apply computers to many technical specialties vital to their future careers, giving faculty members more time to teach and making more effective use of administrative resources. Education and research are being combined in the most imaginative and promising way at the Asian Institute of Technology near Bangkok. Graduate students, engineers, and scientists from more than 20 nations are seeking answers to complex questions which affect the lives of people throughout Asia. And IBM is helping with the loan of a computer and a team of data processing specialists and with a grant to help fund the operation of AIT's regional computer center. Projects range from better methods of flood control to study of soil conditions to improve farming productivity. Solutions to problems are made available to countries throughout Asia, and the work being done here could change the lives of millions. Today's new generation, with a heritage founded on the values of the past, working to meet the problems of tomorrow. IBM is helping in many lands, in many ways. And IBM is people dedicated people, sharing a world of experience, planning for the future. IBM in Southeast Asia, a gathering of talent, dedication, and enthusiasm, of Asian men and women working together in their own nations, but sharing common goals that transcend national boundaries, committed to finding new and better ways to put information to work in the service of people modern men and women in ancient lands at the crossroads to tomorrow.